Welcome to Beyond King 80. Welcome to Beyond King 80. To you, what makes Jesus so different? What makes Jesus so different? to you ah the john king 80 i ask group of people in the meeting ah the john king 80 i ask group of people in the meeting who in your option is Jesus Christ again who in your option is Jesus Christ the response was that he was a great religion leader i agree with that Jesus Christ was a great religion leader but I believe he was much more more than a leader men and women down through the ages have been divided over the question who is Jesus why so much conflict over one individual why is it that is name more than the name of any other religion leader causes erection why is it that you can talk about God and nobody get upset but as soon as you mention Jesus people so of them want to stop the conversation or they become defensive I mentioned something about Jesus to Indian friend in Calgary and immediately immediately he said I don't like to discuss religion especially Jesus how is Jesus different from other religion leader why don't the name of buddha or muhammad or friend people the reason the reason is that those others did not claim the god but jesus did that is what what make him so different from other religion leaders welcome to beyond king 80 what you don't know you shall know it if you are willing we have said and many videos five or six as gone to you say all of them are not leaders all of them are not god i mean all of them are not god they are leaders they are leaders and any leader can lead in his own 
account and so to Jesus as well. And a leader can lead in his own account and so do Muhammad. And a leader can lead in his own account and so do Mormon. Let go what made Jesus so different. What made Jesus so different? Move on the way for you. Continue subscribing to Beyond King 80. Welcome to Beyond Game 80. Welcome to Beyond Game 80. To you and the household. To you and the household. What makes Jesus so different? What made Jesus so different? Follow me. Jesus received honor and worship that only God shall receive in cooperation with Satan. Jesus said, it is written, you shall worship the Lord your God and serve him only. Matthew 4 verse 10. Yet Jesus received worship as God. Matthew 14 verse 33. And sometimes even demand to be worshipped as God was as God. John 5 verse 23 compare Hebrew 1 verse 6 Revelation 5 verse 8 to 14. Most of the followers of Jesus were devout Jewish who believed in one true God. They were most ready to the core, yet they recognized him as God incarnate. Because of his extensive revelation, training, Paul would be even less likely to upon the view duty to Jesus to worship a man from Nazareth and call him Lord. But this is exactly what Paul did. He acknowledged the love of God. Jesus as God. When he said, be on God for yourself and for all the flock among which the Holy Spirit has made you overseas to shepherd the church of God with he proceeds with his own blood. Act 20, verse 28. Peter confesses after Christ asked him who he was, though God, 
the Christ, the Son of the Living God. Matthew 16, verse 16. Jesus was born to Peter. Confession, not by correcting his conclusions, but by acknowledging it validated and source. Blessed are you, Simon, because flesh and blood do not, did not reveal this to you, but my Father who is in heaven. Matthew 16, verse 17. Martha, a close friend of Jesus, said to him, I have believed that you are the Christ, Messiah, the Son, the Son of God. John 11, verse 24. Then there is nothing who did not think anything good could come out of Nazareth. He acknowledged that Jesus was the Son of God. You are the King of Israel. John 1 verse 49 While Shepherd was being stoned, Stephen, I'm sorry, while Stephen was being stoned, he called upon the Lord and said, Lord Jesus, receive my spirit. Up 7 verse 59. The writer of Hebrews called Christ God when he written, when he wrote, but God, but of the Son, he says, though throne, O God, is forever and ever. Hebrews 1 verse 8, John the Baptist announced the coming of Jesus by saying that the Holy Spirit descended upon him in holy form like a dove. And a voice come out of heaven, though thou art my beloved son, in thee I am well pleased. Luke 3 verse 22. Then of course we have the confession of Thomas, better known as the doubter. Brown, he was a graduate student, graduate student, excuse me. Graduate student, he said, I will I won't believe unless I can put my finger into his knee. The scale identified with Thomas, he said, Look not, every day does someone rise himself from the dead or claim to be God in credit. I need evidence. Eight days later, after Thomas, after Thomas is down about Jesus before the other dis discipline, Jesus come the door, having been shot and stood in the midst and said, "Be be with you." Then he says to Thomas, reach here your finger and see my hand, and reach here your hand and put it into my side, and be not unbelieving, but believing.
Thomas answered and said to him, My Lord and my God. Jesus said to him, Because you were seen, because you have seen me, have you believed? Believe are they who do not see and yet be believe. John 22, John 20, verse 26 to 29. Jesus accepted Thomas acknowledgement of him as God. He rebuked Thomas for his unbelief, but not for his worship. At this point, a critic made in truth. Just that all these reference are from other about Christ, not from Christ about himself. The accusation in the class room is usually that those at the time of of Christ misunderstood him as we are misunderstanding him today. In other words, Jesus really did not claim to be God. Why? Wow. I think he did. And I believe that the duty of Christ is derived directly from the faith of the New Testament. The reference are abundant and the meaning is plain. A businessman who is credited the scriptures to verify where, where or not Christ claimed to be God says, for anyone to read the new testimony and not conclude that Jesus claimed to be divine, he would have to be as blind as a man standing outdoor on a clear day and saying he can see the sun. In the Gospel of John where a confession between Jesus and some Jews, it was triggered by Jesus a curing a lamb man on the Sabbath and telling him to pick up his, his palate and walk and for, a, for this reason the Jews were executing Jesus because he was doing these things on the Sabbath day. But he answered them, my father is walking until now, hallelujah. And myself, I am walking for those, for those, for these causes. Therefore, the Jews were seeking all more to kill him, because he not only was breaking the Sabbath, but also was calling God his own father, making him equal with God. John 5 verse 16 to 18. You might say, look, joy, I can say, my father is walking until now, and I myself I am walking. So what? So what? It does not prove anything. Whatever we study a document, we must take into account the, la the language, the culture, and especially the person or persons addressed in this case. The culture is Jewish, 
and the persons addressed as Jewish religion leaders let see how the Jews understood Jesus' remark 2,000 years ago in the own culture. For this case, therefore, the Jews were seeking all the more to kill him because he not only was breaking the Sabbath but also was calling God his own father, making him, making himself equal with God. George 5 verse 18. Why such a drastic reaction? The reason is that Jesus said, My father, not our father. Hallelujah. Did you hear me? My father, not our father. And then added, is walking until now. Jesus shoes of this two verses made himself equal with God on a pair, on a pair with God. And then activity, the Jews did not refer to him as my father, or if they did, they would qualify the statement with in heaven. However, Jesus did not do this. He made a claim that the Jews would not mis mis misunderstood or misreply. Misunderstood when he called God my father, Jesus also implied that while God was walking, he, the son, was walking too. Again, the Jewish understood. Understood. Understood the implication that he was God's son as a result of this statement. The Jewish hatred grew even though they were seeking mainly to persecute him. They, they then began to, to, to desire to keep him. Not only did Jesus claim equality with God as his father, but he also asserted that, that he was one with the father during the past of the duplication in Jerusalem. Jesus was approached by some Jewish leaders who asked about his being. The Christ Jesus ended his command to them by saying, Ah, the Father, our one, John 10, verse 30. The Jewish took up his stone, he stood again to stand, to stood in. Jesus answered them, I show you many good works from the Father, for which of them are you standing or stoning me? The Jewish answered him, For a good work we do not stone you, but for blessed for me, and because you being a man made yourself out of heart to be God. John 10, verse 31 to 33. 
One might wonder why there was such a strong reaction to what Jesus said about being one with the Father. An interesting implication of this peace arise. When the Greek is studied, Greek scholar, scholar A. T. Robert Burton wrote that the one E. Noted, not machically in the Greek and does not indicate one in person or purpose but rather one in extended senses or nature. Robertson then ah this crap statement is the club plumbing of Christ clown about the relations between the Father and himself, the Son, the Star, the Elster, the precedes to uncontrollable anger. It is evident that, it, that in the mind of those who oh, this statement there was, there was doubt that Jesus claimed he was God, my dear mother and mother. Welcome to Pigeon King 80. Welcome to Pigeon King 80. What makes Jesus so different? than others. Mohammed in position what makes Jesus so different than others. Alawin in position what makes Jesus so different than others. Mormon in position what makes Jesus so different than than others. Your father and mother are in position. What makes Jesus so different? You have heard how I started and how it going down. I need you to support this YouTube. Subscribe and say something. Is Jesus indeed a God in your life? Is Mohammed indeed a God in your life? Is Mormon himself a God in your life? Welcome to Pigeon King 80. Subscribe. 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 Subscribe.